You don't know Bad man Yeah, yeah, yeah This body baby, oh Ah, this body baby, oh Yeah, yeah It's a bad man thing, yeah, yeah Bad girl make you want to be this, nah, nah Hey guys, it's your girl Vanessa here. Welcome back to another video. As you saw at the start of the video, I dyed my hair. So if you are interested in finding out how I done this, definitely keep on watching. Now it is a really simple and quick solution to change your look. Um, so if you're looking perhaps to, um, you know, just just have a different hair color for the bend. This is definitely the way to go. So I will be using this um, dye. I got this from Amazon. I will see if I can find the link and link it in the description box, guys. So feel free to check it out. So this comes in many different colors. You've got black, you've got uh, blue, purple, red, and all of that stuff. So definitely feel free to check it out. So this is a temporary... A dye candle situation okay the good thing about this is that it does not damage your hair just like you know going um full-on on dyeing your hair would for example especially if you were to do it at home i think it would definitely not be safe to dye your hair i've always wanted to try different hair color um without necessarily having to damage my strands so i just found that this was a really really good alternative to um to get the look that I wanted essentially so I just thought I would share with you and also show you what my results um, look like after using this now I must say this video is not sponsored in any way um, it's just me playing around with my hair and finding something that I think some of you guys might find useful it also has a black color so yeah feel free to check Amazon like I said I will link this particular one in the description box below so feel free to check it out so to begin with guys I'm working in smaller sections just like you can see here um, my hair is currently my normal color um, and I do have quite a bit of gray at the front but I'm so used to it anyways like it doesn't really bother me um, that much like it used to but yeah, we're just going to be working with it. So I'm wetting the hair first and then I'm going to use this, um, what's it called, moisturising butter that I've got on my website. Um, I will link my website in the, in the description box as well. So feel free to check it out. This is, um, this contains shea butter, mango butter, aloe vera, all of that good stuff. And it's super, super amazing when it comes to um, giving your hair the sort of keeping the moisture in your hair so it's really really good you can also use this for your skin um so i'm just taking a little bit of that and then i'm just rubbing it in my hands and i'm going to put it on my hair and i'm going to go ahead and detangle now the thing about this um particular dye is that it suggests that you apply it to um it doesn't really say it just says like wash your hair um, but I'm imagining that you should apply it to sort of damp or wet hair because since it's water soluble um, It will probably allow you to get that distributed on your hair a lot easily essentially if your hair is a little bit dry or so a little bit wet or damp and it's so nice and creamy honestly um, so nice and clean as you can see it really melts in your hands so essentially you just want to work this through your hair so Take your time, make sure that everything is equally um, kind of distributed so you don't have some bits that are more colored than others. And I was literally shocked, like at the first application, I was like, whoa, this is actually um, something that works basically. So just like you can see from my reaction. Now I'm gonna take my time and just work this through my hair. Now the one thing that I've found is that it does take a bit of time to completely get the golden color um from my black hair color essentially but if you think about it it does make sense because essentially if you were to dye your hair like the proper way 
um, to get this kind of gold color I guess you will probably have to bleach the hair first before achieving that color so I guess this makes sense so you just have to be patient with the application process essentially now I found that this was a little bit dry so I sprayed it with a bit more water and I'm just gonna go ahead and add more of the dye um, until I get the desired gold color that I'm looking for um, so yeah like I said guys it does take a bit of time um, to do this and I literally enjoyed doing this on my hair because I just I, I just love the transformation like how it was looking at first I was taken aback because I was like oh I don't know whether I chose the right color and um, honestly just because I've never had um, I've never had this hair color before so it felt really really um, different and I wasn't really sure whether I liked it but obviously as I went through and finished my hair I was absolutely in love with it so just uh, stay uh, keep on watching so you can see what my um, final results were essentially now I must say this one is quite a good amount as well so you get quite a good amount of the dye in that little um, container because with the amount of hair that I have I did not use everything so there was some left behind obviously not enough to to do another full head of hair for example um but certainly you know i didn't necessarily have to use the whole thing and if you're doing just highlights for example um you may even have to use it twice basically um but obviously i was trying to color my whole hair now i'm not applying this to my scalp guys notice um it's just because i just don't know how this is going to react with my scalp um, and also there's no need really to um to, to kind of dye your scalp right so the bottom of my hair like the roots will probably still be dark but that that's fine um so yeah just just stay tuned so you can see my final results now i decided to work in smaller sections um just because i, I just think it's, it was so much easier to put this on the hair compared to like working with bigger sections um so after i finish with one i'm just going to twist and then move on to the next section and repeat until it's done because essentially what i wanted to do was like a little twist out um so yeah, yeah baby, yeah. What I found about this as well is that it does help to define your curls a little bit as well. I just thought I would show you guys what I mean. Um, so you can see here, I have worked this through my hair and I do have some bits where I have really nice looking curls. And um, obviously it's not like, you know, properly, properly curly, um, but at least it gives you just that little bit of definition. And I think it really helps a lot with the look that I was going for, um, just like you would see later on. Um, towards the end of the video so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and twist that and then repeat Okay guys, so I went ahead and did the rest of my hair off camera um just because i didn't want the video to be too long so this is my hair completely done now around my edges i found because obviously i do have quite a lot of grace um i had to do something there so i was getting a bit tired and i think i just slapped the um 
the dye on it so it doesn't necessarily look really good but i'm going to sort it out because like i said guys this is water soluble so you can just take like a wet baby wipe and just wipe the area that perhaps you um apply too much or maybe it's not properly applied essentially so i undid those twists and this is the curl definition that i'm getting now to make the process of drying a bit quicker for myself because obviously i wanted to just record this video in one go i used a hair dryer normally i would allow my hair to just naturally dry on its own um not that you know if i let this dry on its own it would have taken so long um, but it was just quicker for me to record um, the video so um, I just essentially just open up those twists um, just like you, you do a regular twist out and yeah just to give my hair like volume the one thing I found about this dye as well is that it gives your hair also quite a lot of volume um, I don't really know what it is about it but I really really love this like honestly um, my hair just looks it looks really nice like let me know what do you think about this color do you think it suit me or should i try like a different color next time i think i'll probably try a different color next time maybe the red color um but yeah i really really love this and i loved how defined my curls were as well now obviously at the back i probably just needed to leave the twist in a little bit longer so it did not necessarily curl 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 like that um but it was it was okay it was honestly okay and i really really love it um so yeah let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below is this something that you're likely to try i'm thinking for my grays i might try the black one um because i think it's, i don't know it's just really easy to apply honestly you just need to to work it through and you know when you wash your hair it comes out i think i'm probably going to order the black one um just for those times that i don't necessarily want to wear my grace essentially so yeah i really love this so this brings me to the end of the video guys i hope that you've enjoyed watching and if you did please please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to the channel guys if you're not already like i said leave me a comment in the section in the comment section down below let me know what you think of this is this something you're likely to try have you tried it before did you know something like this existed um yeah let me know in the comment section down below and don't forget to share the video as well and then i will catch you in my next video bye